everybody and welcome back to another vlog i know it's been um a little hot second minute you know what i mean but it's been a lot going on we have been packing working all of these things trying to get ready to go to the beach we're gonna get ready to um i'm actually getting ready right now um because we're i think we're planning to try to leave about 11 30 ish and it's about to be 10 and I know it's, I'm trying to finalize on the packing and everything. Packing up a family of five, especially when you have two toddlers, it's quite a bit. We are heading to Daytona Beach. We will be staying at Bahama House. I will give you guys a room tour. I will give you a um, hotel tour so you can kind of see what they have to offer so if you ever choose to book or come down for like a beach weekend or a beach staycation i got you Alrighty, so let's go ahead and get all of these bags and things together get the kids together get myself together and we'll head on out all right y'all so we now are packing up the house and we are gonna get ready to go. I'm trying to turn this down. This Sonic or whatever. So I'm trying to hurry up so we can start hitting the highways and byways. Oh, and by the way, you guys, I cut my hair. I will have a um, in-depth video regarding how I cut my hair and all that good stuff and jazz. I'll show y'all the little outfit of the day and what I'm wearing before we head on out. So let me show you what I've got going on. So I have this little halter top. Okay. I got a chin and then I have these shorts from Shein, as you can see. And then I have these um, shoes that I also got from Shein as well. My little shoes. And then I also look these little press on toes, child. Help them chin. So they getting the job done. That's all that matters. So we're packing up the car right now and taking stuff out to the car. I'm gonna take this duffel bag because this is the boys stuff that I got. Their clothes, our little food pack. So Let's pack up and let's go. It is sweltering hot, guys. Isn't it? It's hot. Not that bad of a drive to go to the beach, spend a weekend, and have family time. It's not a game. It's a red thing.
So now this is is the brisket. That right there. What kind of burrito is that one? That is the is that the fajita one? No, nah, Philly Philly cheesesteak. Oh, the Philly cheesesteak. Mm. It's very, very good. And then I got some pecans. These are um, uh, candied pecans. They look like this. So good. 10 out of 10. What about Bucky's? All right, y'all. We at this little shopping center that's across from Bucky's over here. Um, you got a bunch of stuff. You got Raw Dollar Tree. There's five below Burlington. It's a whole bunch of stores. So we're gonna head on in here to. I want to go to Dollar Tree because some Dollar Trees have stuff and some don't. So I definitely want to check that out. We got a bunch of stuff out of there. So now we are heading to Ross right now. Rose. Buy nothing but toys. Yeah. Come on, children. Single pile. So good in here. Ooh, look at this. They got this also little seating area. Office area. Chairs. 802. So we have 802. Come in. Let's see. Ooh, we have to do a room tour. Wow. These are renovated. So lovely. Alrighty, so I'm gonna give y'all a quick room tour. A quick room tour. Uh, we got a double queen suite room with a kitchenette. So I'm gonna show y'all real quick. Okay, this is the front door. You have a full size refrigerator. This is full size, like full size, y'all. And you have a freezer right here. Then you have a microwave. They give you cups. You get bowls, plates, dishes, sinking area, toaster, and you get a coffee maker. This right here, you actually get like a hot plate, so you can actually cook items, which means that we may have some utensils here to cook with, bottle openers, and then you have your pots area as well coming into here we have a big size mirror big size mirror yes big size mirror 
And then you have your two beds, queen beds. Queen beds that they're on. Table with the two chairs. And then you have a lounge chair here. Clock, now this clock has USB ports as well as regular outlet plugs. Lamp right there. Another lamp, phone. Phone is here. And then you open here, you have where your Bible is. Plasma TV right here, the remote. Um, it looks like they give you a lineup of the channels that you can watch. And then these are your housekeepers. They leave a little note about who's cleaning the room and who has cleaned the room. So that's perfect. Here are some drawers for storage. Lots and lots of storage on here. Then you have, now the thing about this is it's really, really close. It's cutting it close. But you do have your closet space here. With your iron board, iron, your um, luggage caddy, and um, your hangers, and your safe is here. It's really, really close though. So, but you do have plenty of storage. I'm gonna show you the bathroom. You have your commode, towels, towel rack, towels. Let me check these towels. Okay, it's not getting Crunchville. Um, your sink area, mirror. You get extra everything. And then it looks like you have some bath conditioner. What soap is this? This is Essential Elements Bath Skin Care. Your hair dryer. And then. There's a closet. Yeah. And then you have your um, shower here, which is so nice with a nice little shower head. And then I'm gonna show you guys. Oh, you have a hook where you put your towels and stuff on behind. And then you're going to go. Let's go on the balcony. I'm not gonna. So. All right, this is your balcony. I mean, it's quite spacious and it's windy. It is out here. Again, you see your head. Like, see how windy it is? Downstairs. Alrighty, so you guys got a quick little tour of the place. So I'm gonna go downstairs just to go get some of the stuff uh, out of the car, and then we gonna, you know, put it back in the room. Y'all, look what this man did in my house. What? I got to come in and try to like do something with my hair. Like, look at this. Straight wind. They do offer pool towels. You can get them right here when you get off the elevator. And you have the return where you return all of your stuff. Please return pool towels that they ask. Look at the artwork. We have vending machines with drinks. And this comes out to the pool. Oh, so we get out here to the pool area. They do have accessibility. Let's see what else they have. Little discounts, dynamite discounts. Any other place? They have a hula show. They got a pirate show, an airboat, uh, parasailing, an escape room. All of these things offered. Okay, got all of the things here. Thank you. What's this? Razzles. <laughs> Bro, you want to be funny. Because I used to go to Razzles when I was in college up here. In your outlet area. But it's about 20 minutes away from here. But are you little this little lounge area down here it's very calming I love this chair I 
have a computer. I guess you can look up flights and things like that over there. Very comfortable down here. I'm not even going to lie. It's very comfortable down here. <sighs> so this is where the gym is. It's on the third floor. Exercise room. And it's very small, but it feels good in here. Um, it looks like you get your dumbbells. They got you some complimentary, complimentary waters, towels, wipes. You got treadmill. Look like a what is this called? An elliptical. No, it's just very small. You got basically the three necessities. But see, this does like four things in one. So really, you don't need that many, sorry, equipment. Now, it's real hot in here. I ain't even gonna lie, y'all. It's like they gave it its, um, like a natural heat in here so you can sweat more. So, um, yeah, it's a small, cute, little, quaint little gym. You really only have like four or five items and dumbbells. You don't have much of room to do like anything else, but it'll get the job done while you're on vacation. Get your walk on, get a quick little um, power in. You may lift some weights just to do some light weights. And to be honest, no one's in here now and it's like after five. So this might be like the prime time to do a work, quick workout before dinner, or you can probably go uh, early in the morning because it's open at six. So. Do your morning, go straight downstairs and do your continental breakfast, and then you're good for the day. All right, and we made it to this restaurant called Land Shark Grill and Bar. So we're gonna try this. I did a quick board up change. We are back in the room. I don't know that place. Okay, so like the fish tacos was good and the sauce that the lady gave was good. The atmosphere was okay. Um, what you give it out of a five for the restaurant? I, said, I, mean, it just, I, I said out of five. Stop it. Get some help. Okay, out of ten, since you want to be difficult, what do you? It ain't difficult. That what do you? Like, uh, <laughs> the way people charade. Okay, so out of ten, what do you give the restaurant a seven? I give it a six point five, honestly, because we had a good. We had the drink was good that I had the watermelon lime lemonade. The tacos was good with the sauce, but I just feel like, I don't know, it just, it wasn't like, 
what I thought it was gonna be. We were out on uh, we we were kind of like out on the beach where you could see the, like the the actual ocean, um, cause it's set up the restaurant. But you know, I think some of the food was kind of like overpriced. But yeah, that for yourself. It's an okay place. Uh, the Margaritaville's version restaurant type thing. So. But I'm going to put my PJs on. I'm going to go to a couple of my family's rooms to hang out with them. And we're going to call today a night. And then in the morning, we're going to get up for breakfast, go down to the pool area, hang out at the pool, hit the beach, all of that good jazz. And that'll be that. But I will see y'all in the morning. Good night. The next day. to the beach got a little beach toys it's windy but it ain't as windy as it was yesterday that's back there and then get our toes in the sand build some sand castles and play in the water 